Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to How Farms Work. Today we are down at Travis's place, and Travis is in the 8235R. He is currently putting down anhydrous on the what is going to be corn ground for next year. So when I pulled down here, I actually was wondering whether it was foggy out or whether someone lit a fire somewhere. And I think I've decided that someone lit a fire somewhere because, I mean, the fog kind of has like a blue hue, which tells me that it's smoke. And I'm starting to get a whiff of it right now and it doesn't really smell like anything that's legal. <laughs> it kind of smells like burned rubber. And uh, I feel sorry for whoever lit it because, I mean, this whole valley is just co covered in smoke. So, Travis is down over the hill. Um, he finished my place last night, and he's down at his place now, and this is the last farm that has an hydrus put down. So, I, unfortunately, I got a meeting this afternoon. Um, I'm going up to the Farm Bureau meeting in the Dells. Uh, I got a sponsorship earlier this year from Rural Mutual Insurance, I think. And um, they they paid for me to go and attend and uh, for my stay there. So I didn't imagine that we would still be doing anhydrous into December. So, but that's the name of the game, I guess. At least we should be, by the time we're done here, we should be ahead. So I don't think he really has that much left to do. Um, he is back on this back hillside now. Uh, it looks like he's got everything done up front. Uh, after this, he, after this last hillside over here, he probably just has the back 40 to do. But um, I haven't been back there to see, but I, I doubt he has it done, but it's a possibility. So, it's a beautiful day out, but I mean, a mix between that smoke and that anhydrous, I can just smell it. It's kind of choking me out, but anyway, let's go see what he's doing.
starting to really wind down. I'm gonna take the time to work out how my crop finances went this year. Um, I know that it's not pretty. I mean, I'm really not forward to uh, adding it all up, but since it's the end of the year anyway, I've, I've got to do it anyway, so. Anyway, with that, this should be about it for this video. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to check out all of our other videos. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and be sure to check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat, all how farms work. I'm looking forward to doing more stuff next year. I mean, I got a lot of stuff that I've got planned as far as, you know, with the pastures and stuff, and I got, I got plans for the rhino mower, and um, I got another surprise coming down the, coming down the pipeline. Um, hopefully that should go through. At least to, to my knowledge, it should. And what we're getting should be pretty useful, uh, especially for, you know, maintaining the pastures and fighting back against the trees. Because, like I've like I've said in my previous videos, that tree trees and tree li or and fence lines are the bane of my existence. So, all right. Well, thanks for watching, guys.